What do you do if it's your lunch hour? You don't want to go home. You don't want to stay in the office. You're also not quite hungry. And you've been wondering, when am I going to find the time to go to the store by myself? Because I'm a mom. I mean, the only time I have off, I also have the kids with me. So, when can I go by myself? And I've realized today, oh, I could take my lunch hour and go to the Dollar Tree down the street. That's what I did. So if I go home today starving, my fault, but I felt like I had to do this. And I'm actually not that upset that I made this choice because the person that I'm like, oh, he's going to be really hard to find for, um, actually got the most stuff in this haul. <laughs> we decided, and I let everybody know, we probably can't afford to do adult presents this year. Mortgage shot up. Thanks, taxes. But... Some things had already been bought for stockings, so we decided we're still doing stockings. I just spent thirteen thirty-six at the Dollar Tree. My Dollar Tree is still only a dollar. The thirty-six cents is because Pennsylvania has a six percent tax on every dollar. So there you go. Let's begin. <laughs> okay, so to start with, I am responsible for the stockings for. My brother-in-law, my husband, Amy, our nanny, and uh, the two children, Santa. Santa's really responsible for them, but you know. I thought that Aaron might be one of the harder ones. My husband might be one of the harder ones. The kids are easy, and Dollar Tree has a lot of stuff for the kids. Some stuff I'm like, oh, I could get that and that and that, but I'm like, I only have like $13 and change, so I should slow my roll. <laughs> so, to start with, Aaron. Aaron doesn't like a lot of candy. Aaron mostly likes Skittles and sour candy. Luckily, it seems that Warhead and the trolley stuff went crazy this year. So I have a bunch of trolley and warhead stuff, like this warhead candy cane. It's sour apple flavor, I believe. Yeah, green apple. I hope he likes it. And I also got him um, the trolley trees, the warhead holiday mix, this Sour Patch Kids holiday edition, and then there's something else. Oh, here it is. The Warhead Ooze Chews. Merry Cherry and Jolly Apple. So those will go nicely in his stocking. And I hope he likes all of it. And I hope he eats all of it. And I hope my sister doesn't freak out that I got him all this candy. But, like, honestly, this year, most people are getting candy. I don't... We're not going to do, like, gift cards and crazy expensive stuff in the stocking this year because I just can't. I just can't. I'm not ashamed to say it. I can't. I can't this year. I think that's all. Oh, no. no. One other bit of candy I got. I got these Andy's Mints. Um, Amy likes these. So her stocking is going to be entirely filled with cotton candy and Andy's. I can find more cotton candy. I tried finding it in this Dollar Tree and I couldn't. I got her one bag of the snowballs, like a different one, I think. And this time, no, nah, didn't have any of the cotton candy. So hopefully Target has it. They usually do. Hmm, what is that? Okay. I uh, got this sippy cup. It's not really a sippy cup. It's just a cup. Maybe it's a sippy cup. Would this qualify as a sippy cup? I don't know what's a sippy cup anymore. Anyway, um, this is for my son. It's not that he can't drink out of a cup. He can. He just really likes container play. So buying him a cup with a lid usually just leads to less spills. And I think it's cute. It'll last probably through the winter season. And then if it breaks, it was only a dollar. My son is also getting this um, giant car ramp thing that daddy bought well Santa bought <laughs> and 
I told him we probably didn't need to get him any cars because he has a whole gallon bag filled with little Matchbox cars. But I figured a couple new ones in his stocking wouldn't be so bad. I liked these designs. So really, because he's three, he doesn't really have an aesthetic choice. As long as it has wheels and it goes, he's fine. So we got this Matchbox uh, Chevrolet 1930. The car is a 1934 Chevy Master Coupe. It's pretty. That's a pretty car. And this is a 2019 Volkswagen Beetle convertible. I just wish it was a funky color and not just white. But that's just me. I can't find like anything for my husband in there. <laughs> I don't know. I just, nothing was screaming Tom except like they had these Juncture crew socks for men, size 6 to 12. He's actually a size 13, but I think they're stretchy enough that they could fit him. And he likes pumpkins. These have pumpkins and like the little red truck with pumpkins on it. So I figured he'd like that. Adults love socks. That's what I'm finding. Like there's always this joke about like, oh, somebody got you socks for Christmas. No, as a, like college age and up, you get socks for Christmas, it's a good time. I got this dough kit for my daughter because she likes hands-on crafty stuff like this and she hasn't done very much modeling and I think because this is like step-by-step -step modeling instructions she'd like it and I think for five years old not it would be good it's not for intended for children under three good thing she's not <laughs> mm, squishy so got this for my daughter she likes frozen and she needs her ties so this works out and they're really pretty and sparkly. I love it. All right, this last thing. <laughs> Might have bought it because I was like, oh my God, I remember those. But it's this little toy that, oh, do it, do the thing, do the thing. You push the buttons, it makes the air move the rings. I had things like this when I was little, I remember. I love them. I was thinking I would give this to my daughter, but this actually seems more like a fidgety kind of toy. So I think my son might actually kind of enjoy this. I'm enjoying this <laughs> as I play with it while doing this video. Come on, come on. Oh, okay, stop, stop. I got some though. That's, that's fun. So that was my $13 haul, kind of a modest haul all stocking stuffers. I'm happy everything I got for Aaron. He's going to get finished first, which is surprising. Um, my plan right now is I'm buying candy probably next week because I know ShopRite's having a buy one, get one free for Hershey candy. And I plan on filling everyone's stocking with chocolate. Maybe not my husband's. I don't think he's, he's not as fond as chocolate as me, but the kids, the kids love chocolate. And the one thing that they were upset about last year, not like upset, like they cried, but I, I did hear complaints. <laughs> um, Santa didn't bring a lot of candy in their stocking because I'm like, oh, they're little, they don't need a lot of candy, but they were offended because all the adults got candy, like good candy, chocolate, good candy. And they got a little bit of it. So, <laughs> congratulations, children. You get to have candy this year. And mommy's going to fill it right up. They only get candy like three times a year. Halloween, Christmas, and Easter. And this past Halloween was tragic with candy. We still have a giant bag of candy. Because nobody's eating it. It's all like hard candy and lollipops. And while my daughter likes lollipops, she doesn't want them on a daily basis. So we still have... Halloween candy, and I don't think anyone's going to eat it. I should just, like, take it to work and be like, take what you want. But, thank you for watching my haul. If you stuck her, it's probably going to be a short one because I have to edit it down. It's only at 11 minutes. So, thank you for stopping by. Hope you enjoyed your time here. If not, sorry. I do my best. <laughs> oh. Uh, I'm going to start the car and head back to work now because it's 1247 and I have to get back by one. All right. Well, thank you so much. Have a good day. Mwah. Bye.